up until about a year ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever. Brooklyn. Represent. Had two cool parents and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed, though, when my dad was killed in the city hall bombing. I... I couldn't believe... So from, uh... I believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me. And I started to... change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially Spider Bros. He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds.
Gracias, chico. De nada. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The key? Yeah, maybe. Original's just my guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case. Spider-Man protect the giant prison convoy? You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 on route, heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2, we've got you all scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances. Especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Doc is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion. 
could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take. I got this, Pete. Don't worry. Oh, no. <laughs> it's secure. It's okay, we got this. Just need to contain it before... Before that happens. Hello, time spiders. Destruction. Tomorrow's bugle headline's gonna be a doozy. 
worst thing out of this is a bad headline? I'm a count as lucky. Anywhere. Uh, you've got Alexei. 
these guys. Exchange for new one. Oh. This one will do. Miles, get out of here. Bro. Back the hell.
You alive? Kinda. Guys? Wow, just... <laughs> wow! Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry. I think our ball landed in your yard. No. Actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But, uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you. Both of you. Taken down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks, but he, he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you. <coughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest. Little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh, man. Yeah. yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you. I'm not going to be around for the next few weeks. This is some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the Bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup. And you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath the real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up. The city laid in my head of pedophile. Shot it on the map of the below for those on the game. They know the true form of pure evils are visible, so I keep a lot of vision.
Yo, Genki. Dude, Rhino? What? <laughs> yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment, okay? Yeah, your mom let me in. Unpacked slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park, grabbing some air. Oh, perfect. Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Pics I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts. <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there. Them kiss go hard. Change the scope ball. Flow somewhere in the stars. Probably waiting at the amphitheater for me. I'll never get used to you doing that. Hey, look, check it. Christmas present from Spider Man. Open it. Dude, put it on. I'll cover you. What? Never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Head up down for part two of this amazing gift. This is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Hey, Spider-Man. Welcome to Just the Facts. With me, your truth-slinging host with the most, Gay Jonah Jameson. What? Does Pete set his suits to autoplay Jameson's show? Guys, I'm asking. Sad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to masked vigilante mayhem. Gotta be something better on. <sighs> Been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Danica Hart, and this is the Dancast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our city. Today's topic? Oh, you know, stock brokers, for profit colleges, maybe the people who make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> No, obviously we're covering Spider-Man's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, Danacast, new favorite podcast. the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. Miles, get ready for your first holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. 
Fighting the enemy on your turn is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite, the Swing Kick. This holotech is next-gen! With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Tons of high-tech gear we can sell. Uh, oh, crap. Spider-Man! Uh, Take them out! Then grab the gear! Y'all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay, let's go. Take the spider out, then grab the tech gear. Gonna make bank selling this stuff off. Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech. Y'all are not authorized to resell. Russell! Uh, these guys are see-through! How are these guys see-through? Well, to advanced quick training. Remember, specificity is the heart of every space For example, instead of, hey, ugly, try, oh, nice mask. Wait, that, that's your face? That's not a quip. That's a straight-up bird. Keep practicing this.
That's it for the tech thieves. Now to fix a training sim. Critical fault on circuit AF-15. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice. That did it. it looks like P made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. I think you should check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah. I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. How about Venom Power? You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom Power. Trust me, it's gold. chance to revise my gut reactions. So I thought, what if everybody had that friend? What if I could be that friend for them? That's why I'm Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan, and then, worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuform. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. We did a search for new food. What were they gonna do with it? <laughs> Man, this 
Savage is not quick. Your tech is unbelievable, but Venom totally wrecks it. Yeah, Genki's right. Venom's a good name. Just slow them down if I use my new Venom power.
They were talking about new form shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments. But why? Rock's on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. I gotta get home. Christmas dinner sounded pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group and the new form shipments tomorrow. to change out here. Genki stay in a couple of weeks. Gonna be a lot of late nights working on spider gear. Let's see what Genki's working on. Oh, Speed Nonagon. Dude needs to finish so I can play it. What was that? All good. Little spill. Get it cleaned up real quick. All good. <laughs> it's all right, man. Ay, bendito. Mijo, qué guapo. <laughs> Gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, uh, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Naja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? Espera hasta que llegue la hora de la cena, por favor. Yes, ma'am. Yo pensé que ya habíamos llenado ese formulario. No. Ay, esto nunca termina. Hmm. No records. Hey, mom. Where's dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. El hijo qué? No, no, no te creo. Ese hombre está loco. I'm gonna make you proud, dad. Como cuántos estamos esperando mañana? En serio. Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. No, no lo creo. Is the mystery guest Uncle Aaron? Un segundo. You know I don't want him coming around here. I just thought. Never mind. Let's talk about it later, okay? 
Nadja, I'm back. That looks okay, right? Still gotta box up the last of Abuela's stuff and ship it to her in Puerto Rico. This <coughs> really hasn't sunk in yet. Still feels like Abuela's apartment, not ours. Guess Mom's not done unpacking either. That wallpaper just screams Abuela. But what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of Dad's old case files. Who's the prowler? I wonder if Dad ever caught the guy. I haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. Salsa from Abuela. Mom and Dad would move when this came on. I think this was Uncle Aaron's. Dad never played it, but he also never got rid of it. Mom ordered like a hundred of these because the article mentioned Dad. Who is the Spider-Man? If only you knew, Ma. Bleached borax. Mom City Council run came together fast. Hey man, people in Harlem really love her. What's the hit, DJ? The greatest record ever. I didn't like jazz when I was little. Your dad taught me to love it. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. How are your parents, Genki? I haven't talked to them in a while. Finn? Hey, fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like months. A lot's changed. Yeah, it really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn. My best friend. <laughs> My other best friend. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a... Uh, energy, energy converter? converter. <laughs> Jinx! <laughs> oh. uh, the wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. So, Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey. But be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. Do you see any 
People on the roof. Can't go up there. Yeah, that's the whole block. Really hope no one can see me up here. Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. Think Miles is having any luck outside? I hope so. Hot plates are only going to get us so far in salvaging this dinner. Bioelectricity can take down Rhino. But can it save Christmas dinner? Keep him distracted, Genki. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, uh, <laughs> what about a photo? <laughs> right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Oh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. Hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <laughs> so, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean, it's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No, it's, I don't know anybody here. And I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant, a barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay. I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean, not a date. Uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> Miles. 
What? You awake? No. So I stayed up last night and designed an app for your new suit. Thing's got a crazy custom OS, nothing I've ever seen before. But I ran it through a disassembler so I could reverse engineer the plugin architecture and... Uh, you just fell asleep again, didn't you? Miles! I'm up. I'm up. It's almost done compiling. Oh, thank you. Ready to try out my app? Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm connected to your analytics. Let's test drive this baby. All right. I can see everything you see. How are you not puking all the time? Lots of practice. Welcome to Friendly Neighborhood 1.0. It lets New Yorkers directly request your help and report crimes in progress. Nice UI. Thanks. Look, someone just made a request. The request came from a guy named Aaron Davis. Wait, what? That's my uncle. Does he know you're Spider-Man? No. Gotta be a coincidence. Uh, I'm headed to the subway stop. Some help? I'm Spider-Man, by the way. Yeah, I know. Aaron Davis. I think somebody's messing with the sensors. I'm getting bad data from the main relay up top of Grand Central. On my way. Wait, wait. Yeah? Where's the other Spider-Man? Oh, he's on vacation. But don't worry, I got this. <laughs> He definitely didn't recognize me. Oh, he's calling through the app? This is Spider-Man. Hey, forgot to mention it. There was a break-in last night right next door at Roxanne Plaza. Who called the Underground? Caught him hanging around my stop this morning. The Underground? You know anything else about them? They think of themselves as a young mom. They've been around a while. Now they've got a new boss. Tinker. Tinker. Thanks for the tip. So, uh... You call Spider-Man often? Like, for help? <laughs> Didn't really have a way to get in touch to this app thing. But I saw you on the news last night taking down Ronnie. Figured you were the right person to call. <laughs> cool. Have you, uh, been working at the subway long? Nah, took the job last year after my brother. Well, anyway, I was trying to make some changes. Decided this job was a good place to start. The train going down on my watch doesn't exactly paint me in a good light. Well, when we fix them, you can tell your boss you showed initiative by using the Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man app. <laughs> I'll do that. Good luck with the sensors. sensors. There are way too many wires on this one. It's got to be messing with the signal. Where do these cables go? Inside that shack. Yeah. 
Relays are being jammed by something. Hmm. This is crazy tech. Hate to do this, but. Senses are back online. What did you do? Took care of the guy messing with it. And it looks like they left some of their toys behind. Hey. I'm gonna have to call you back. Whoa. Bet I can use this to make those hollow drones peak design. Tech has a pretty unique RF. Wonder if I can track it. Huh. It looks like there's a bunch more of these around the city. Okay, hope the trains are running again. Should check in with Uncle Aaron. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Davis, how are things looking now? I've got a signal, but no trains on the tracks. Something must have gone down at the yard. It was the underground messing with your sensors. I'm thinking, does Roxxon ever use a subway to ship new form? Roxxon? Uh, the subway system was designed to carry people, not freight. This line got some updates from Roxxon Plaza. So they could be using it under the table. Hmm. I'll follow up on it. So, uh, you mentioned your brother. You got other family? I haven't seen them in a while. I had to make some changes. Like taking his job. I miss him. 
especially my nephew. We used to mix beats together. Well, maybe now you can see him again. Zen, this is your family. Oh, so kid. Yeah. Uh, I should go. Fight underground. Bye. Ground's wrecking everything. Maybe I can stop them quietly. Hurry it up! Take work on us and get in and out quick. Stop this time, man. those guys up. Time to try out Pete's visor tech. Nice. Now I can track them.
Am I close? I'll show you what we can do! Yeah. It's just gonna... Stop it! Grab that! That's all of them. Now to get the trains back on the tracks. Controls are probably in the office. Tinkerer. Unk said that's their leader. <coughs> oh man, they read the controls. Gonna have to get the trains back on the tracks by hand. Or web. I can use that turntable. Spin the turntable? Pull trains with webs. Should work. Almost there. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Now for the others. When the ground looks up new form shipments, then kills the subways. Maybe they're trying to stop new form from reaching the city, or... What? out to him as miles my dad never talked about what happened between them must have been bad this train's gonna block that one Gotta move another train, just like the first.
got trains on the tracks. Now they need power. Hmm. They busted the controls here, too. But not the generator. Okay. I can use that to power the trains. Probably. My webs are conductive. Change on your end? Panels just lit up like Christmas. Good job, kid. Glad to help. If anything else comes up, just post a note in the app. Wait a second. I got a little something here for you. It's not much, but... For... for me? It's the least I can do for the guy who just saved my job. Cool, cool. I'll head back now. in our neighborhood. Classic. You have a plan? Sort of making it up as I go. The mark of a true Spider-Man. Well, if you need me, I'm a phone call away. And a cross-Atlantic flight, but it's fine. Sure, man. Oh, and thanks for the gift. It is awesome. You earned it. Oh, MJ needs me. Gotta go. Bye. Dude, fixing the subways made the app blow up. You have so many requests. Like, uh, oh, this one's from Teos. That guy rules. Oh, I should definitely check that out, now that the whole city's counting on me. We're like the number one app in NYC right now. Check it out as soon as you're done with your uncle. He still doesn't know you or you, right? Had a couple near misses, but I kept my cover. I'll check the app as soon as I'm done here. Later. I can. Hang tight and don't go outside.
bombs. I'm running out of time. Get them! Shipped by train. Then today you attacked the trains. Why? 
to stop new form to steal it oh. are back, underground's done. You do good work. Okay, I'm bored. The next train is arriving in five minutes. Please stand clear of the approaching train. Underground did a number on my suit. Could do a patch job. You okay, Mr. Davis? Yeah, thanks to you. Oh, hey, here you go. One year unlimited subway pass. Thanks. Did I get the name right? 
How did you... Um, okay, gotta go. Hold up, Miles. I kind of suspected when I saw the news yesterday. Watching your moves on those escape cons, juking guys left and right, could have sworn I was back at the park playing pickup with you and your dad. You were quick then. A lot quicker now. Don't worry. I won't tell your mom. Promise? Promise. Look at you. If your dad can see you now... He'd probably freak out. <laughs> He'd definitely freak out. So you taking over for the other Spider-Man? Nah. Like I said, he's just on vacation. Right. And he left you in charge. Yeah. A lot of responsibility for a kid your age. I can handle it. Hope so. But listen, you get in over your head, you give me a call. I'm here for you. you got it? Got it. Thanks, Uncle. <laughs> Genki said the app's blowing up. City definitely needs a Spider-Man. She'll patrol for a while. Hola, mijo. I wanted to tell you my favorite food truck will be at the rally tonight. Look out for a logo with a giant euro. <laughs> okay, thanks for the tip. Oh, Mom, I wanted to ask, since you know everything going on in Harlem right now, have you heard of the underground? Uh, yes. They've been vandalizing rocks on property, and I think they've been recruiting kids around the neighborhood. Why? But they didn't try to get you involved in the mess, did they? No, no. Uncle Aaron told me about them. Uh, yeah. I ran into him at the subway stop by our house. Did you know he's working there? No. You know I don't want you around here. <sighs> but you and Dad never told me why I wasn't allowed to see him anymore. He used to come by our place all the time. That's for Aaron to explain. Give me one second. Sorry, honey. We're still setting up. It's all good. Go save the world, Mom. One boat at a time. Have I ever told you you're my favorite son? I've got Steve competition. Love you. Bye. Harlem. This is home. Yes. Miles, we still meeting today? Never got a text back from you. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I've been wrapped up in my own stuff. But I'm free now. Where? Sweet. 78th and West End. 78th? By the Science Center? Why there? You'll see. Don't be late. 78th and West End. Guess I'll find out what she means. Better hustle over. Feel too bad taken from the underground.
just picked a feast truck for you. It's getting robbed. that you just can't get out of your head. It's a scene from a movie, a headline you read on the back of someone else's newspaper, or your friend's play-by-play -play of a who proved a very bad date. Well, for me, that story is the underdog. Who are they? What do they want? What's infuriating is that the question is so simple that it seems impossible to answer. They steal, hurt, kidnap, and harass. They hit businesses and crime families alike. They have next-level technology and a grudge against everyone. <sighs> I'm gonna keep looking into them, and if you have a tip, please send it my way. Until next time, remember not to put your coffee grounds in the garbage disposal, or we'll clog up your drink and throw back. Okay, bye! Someone reported a mugging at a donation stand. 